<laughs> Where we left off on uh, the Minecraft single player, we were doing the fence around the the place here. Uh, I think that was a morning stream. So now we're gonna go all the way around the compound. And what we're gonna do is once we're fenced in, I'm gonna light it all. Just make sure it's all lit, well lit, so we don't get bullshit, you know, shitty McShits around here. Um, and start building little buildings and stuff. I'm gonna make little, little. I'm gonna make this a compound. Um, and I'm gonna release the chickens. I am going to release the chickens from the chicken pen. Um, now currently it's not really bred. There's not too many in there. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna. I, mean, I actually probably should start breeding them now. Um, and then we'll continue on with the the fence pudding. Um, and then probably go from there. And then chat because I love chatting with the chat. So yeah. <laughs> Bit of hand since the Herschel's land. Oh, damn. Nice. That's a long-ass time. And I cannot... I still can't believe to this day that we did that with Chandler, Chandler Riggs and actually had Scott Wilson in a video. So, man, that was crazy. That was surreal times, man. That was surreal times, man. Um, but, yeah. That's awesome. Glad I could get back. Hell, yeah. Well, thank you for the support. I appreciate it. Um, so, yeah. This is what we got working with right now. God damn... You sheep. I know I freed you sheep. I kind of did an early test freeing with the sheep. I let that I had a pen and I just said fuck it and so I just let them walk around. But now they're getting in the chicken pen and that's no me gusta. Mmm, die. Um I don't have any seed on me, so I'll just I'll load up the egg launcher here. Put the eggs that are in here, and that'll be our initial breeding. There's still babies in here. I haven't been in here since the last time I streamed. Typically I try to um, I'll sometimes just listen to podcast and um, uh, just play Minecraft recently a little bit, um, and uh, more so recently I've just been working while listening to podcasts. Like doing the GTA stuff, uh, doing the Rusty Barbecue is super awesome to just do it all while I'm listening to podcasts because it, it I not I, I'm focusing on what I'm doing in the thing, but I don't need like the audio or anything so because um, I'm rendering it out. Uh, don't animals despawn if they aren't boxed in 20 to so, Well, that's why, like I said, the sheep were kind of a test, and it's working. So, even then, I'm still gonna have the chicken pen going, and it's not gonna be insane, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna unleash the mass of them there, and then, then unleash the chickening. You know what I'm saying? Oh, and then restart my, uh, my pen. So, it won't be like I'm, I'm betraying or sacrificing the pen, you know? So I'm not worried. It's just, this is, it's, I'm a sick person and I want to see chickens everywhere. And if I have some seed on me, I might just might make them fuck in front of me. And that's not weird at all because this is my, this is my kingdom. <laughs> ah, the watcher chicken's still there. One day he might get pelted by an egg though, and he may die. All right, well that's all the, the birthing I'm doing currently, so. <sighs> that seems fantastic. All right, well the... The, the fence was going on over there through the mountain pass. I may... What should I do? I wonder if I should just kind of um, fill this little canyon here and make it level with this and kind of build this up to a thing and then fence it to here and then go there and the, you know this will be the outer boundary you know what I'm saying? Um, and this will this will be part of the outer border. I think that's what I'm gonna do. That might be the easiest way and most fun, because then I'm not just fucking doing stupid fence all the way around. I want to play some blocks, damn it, outside of fences. All right, let's go get some dirt. I'm gonna need some dirt for this mission. Bam, 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 bam. <sighs> Chicken fucking is the best kind of fucking. I mean, Crazy Bob, you hit the nail on the head right there. I absolutely agree. Hey, Liz. How was your workout? Workout delicious. Liz was working out. She was getting the big muscles going. You were getting the muscles worked. What's up? Is there a kitty in here now? I heard a kitty. Hey yo. 
Did you do the jar height? I did, Trevor. I did that. It's one of the things that took me slightly longer to get the stream started. Uh, but I did do that. Aw, cheer. Okay, well, we got some dirt in there. Oh, Fisher's in here. Hey, Fisher. I hope you don't start me out at the door to get out. Because then I'll have to let you out. Liz let you in. But I'll never let you out. And he's like, yeah, whatever. Shut up. Let me out. <laughs> you still play Minecraft with Liz? No, we haven't We haven't played since uh, the last time we recorded that. Although I wouldn't... Uh, that'd be pretty awesome if we could figure out... We're, we're going to see if we can kind of stream at the same time at some point. We're going to test that. Because um, she's going to uh, get her streaming back going. Um, she's getting the whole stream computer set up. Oh, by the way, Selena and Bruce and daughter are doing well. They're so, that's so beautiful. That one's Bruce. That's Selena. And that's the daughter. If you couldn't tell. I know. And you know, Bruce always has to be front and center, you know? Do some chicken hangings. Oh my goodness. That was James's thing. My God. I would never do that unless they were having sex and I was also choking myself a little bit. I mean, what? <clears throat> That's for my private time, everybody. <laughs> Stream goal. You're going to assume you dyed your hair because he did it. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Because he did it. It's okay. Uh, oh, because Jordan did? Oh, no. It was just, it was just stream goal. Uh, I mean, it, it just he took forever to dye his. I, I, I was thinking it would be funny if I would have dyed his before, or dyed mine before he had dyed his. Okay. Have good sleep. Mwah. Want to do Minecraft at some point if we can get the dual stream going? People were asking. Do I want to do Minecraft? Yeah. Don't we have to pay for a server? Yeah, if we can pay for a server at some point. Yeah. Maybe we'll see. I'll just get lost like I always do. Yeah. Hi everybody. Bye everybody. <laughs> Hi everybody. Bye everybody. All right, have a good sleep, babe. Yep, I want to light up on it. Sorry. All right, is the kitty out of here? Yeah, she's out. Okay, cool. Night, love you. Um, do land. You can do land. I could do land. We could do land. We could do land. Hamachi, right? Yeah. Yeah, see? Yeah. We can make it work, y'all. So that. We'll do that. Oh, I got to lose his arm. I know. Oh. She's stacked. Well, she's she she works at you know she stocks, so she's lifting all day long. Oh, bits bits bits. Um, so all of that. What was I doing? Dirt. We were getting dirt. Um, but yeah, no, Liz is Liz is stacked. She's getting damn muscles. All right, I should probably dig out the sand that's over there with my diamond chouvre. Um. We should probably put some of this bullshit that we have on us <clears throat> to a place that is not bullshit. I hope that's enough. That should be enough, right? Um, enough dirt for at... Yeah, I think that should be enough dirt for the jab. I believe in that dirt. I believe in Harvey dirt. I'm going to put water in this other bucket, too. My lava bucket, since I don't have any lava currently anyway. Um, I, I I put it down in the basement to chuck shit out. Hey, oh, shy Violet. Violet resub for three months. Hell yeah, Violet. You got the three month badge. Oh, the three month badges are hitting today. Jala um resubbed uh, this morning and hit the three months as well. Um, hey, sorry it took so long to sub again. Oh, no problem. What do you mean it took so long? <clears throat> 94 Robins in the cave. Holy shite. That's crazy, Chal. That's the highest we've been. We're getting so close to 100. What? We are getting so close to 100 subscribers. Thank you guys all so much. All you Robins out there. Helping the Bat Dans fight crime and still have an apartment. Dun, 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 dun. Um, let's see. So none of these have anything. All right. Um, and I'm going to take some seeds just so I could fuck some chickens. I mean, so chickens can... Fuck me. I mean, so chickens, I can, <clears throat> the chickens can have sex with each other is what I, <clears throat> the, oh, all right. Is it nighttime? Yeah, it is. Let's lay down. 
Let's make it daytime. Do, 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 do. You missed your Robin badge. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, was it gone? Dan the chicken. Absolutely. Oh, fuck. Yeah. All right, let's go dig the shit out of some fucking holes and kill a sheep along the way, because fuck sheep. No, you die. <laughs> I turned into Gollum there for a second, or Bilbo in the first movie, where he's like, "Ha!" You know? Remember that part? Bilbo Baggins, do not take me for the conjurer of cheap tricks. What was it? Cheap, whatever. Yeah, something like that. A conjurer of sheep tricks. Do 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 do. -do. I'm not trying to rob you. I'm trying to help you. Yeah. Alright, let's get this wah wah out of the hole. Wah wah out of the hole. No more wah wah. Bye bye wah wah. Cheap trick. Uh, yeah, conjurer of cheap tricks or conjurer of. I can't remember what he says. Cheap trick? Yeah, this is the band. Mommy's alright. Daddy's alright. They both get a little weird. Surrender. Alright, there's no sand or anything over here, so might as well just bury it all. All you know, well, no, I don't want to waste my sand. I was about to say, although you know, I could probably fill this with cobble, honestly, and just cut, eh, whatever. We have dirt. We got dirt. Who gives a shit? Um, and now's a chance to make this look kind of normalish. so I, I guess I'll just make this a little bit of a vanilla hill. You know what I'm saying? Welcome to Vanilla Hill, meow, 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 the premier spot in all of Dan's compound. You know, brown, brown. If you lick it, it does not taste like vanilla, so don't do that. <sighs> I want to make this a bit more not so. I probably shouldn't be doing the outer point before I even get to the inner, but whatever. Just because I want to make this not so, like, wally right here. Wally. Dan's compound sounds like an area in jail. Pretty much. This is Dan's compound, okay? There will be no pointy objects beyond this point. I don't know who that guy is, but he sounds like a guy I want to meet. He says point weird. Point. Bump, 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 bump. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm placing box incredibly... Should probably be doing this systematically. But just point and click and you can get it done. Singing a song. Singing a song. Well, I love if you watch Gotham and do discussion each episode next season. I um I was doing uh the Gotham if you didn't know, if you did know, then good on you. But uh, if you go to a channel, YouTube channel called Geekvolution, uh, we did Gotham City discussions or Gotham discussions um, on his channel for the first, the first half of the the first season. It was before they went on fall break because then I stopped watching it and I didn't have time to um, do the show anymore. So um, they went on without me. But they 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 kept going for a while. I don't know if they still do it, but. Um, I think they just winded, like rounded all the shows up into one big podcast they do. Um, oh, yeah, speaking of podcasts, Geekvolution Podcast. I totally should shout them out. They, uh, if you go to uh, um, search Geek Geekvolution, uh, G-E-E-K-V-O-L-U-T-I-O-N, um, on uh, YouTube, they have some really great podcasts. If you're ever curious about my and um, another guy's opinion on... <laughs> Um, all the Arkham games. We did a podcast on all on all the Arkham games except for Arkham Asylum. So that's a thing. Gotham's been really good this season. Can't wait for season four. All right, I'll have to take your words for it. And I don't know. No, if I if I don't listen to my Robins, then who do I listen to? Okay, Robin, I'll watch that show you always want to watch. But band dance, I want to... Like, like you guys sound like that. But band dance, I want to... Watch the show. Okay. But not before bedtime. Aw. Apparently you're my children. It's like the Lego Batman movie. Aw. That movie was the best. Because friends are family. 
You're my best friend, my best friend. Last episode was really, really good. All right. I'm signed up now. You can stop. <laughs> um, you could stop selling me on it. I'm sold, okay? I'm going to make this un, uh, not, you know, there isn't a happy ending to this hill, you know? Well, I'm going to make it droppable, but I'm going to kind of make a gap between uh, levels. If you know what I mean, if you don't know what I mean, you'll see. Just wait. I don't know what that accent turned into, or was at any of the points, but... Friends are family. It's no everything is awesome, but it's still pretty good. You gotta watch it now. Yeah, I know. They make it sound so, uh... So unmissable, you know? Alright. Oh, this is gonna take fucking forever, isn't it? I should... <laughs> Uh, have you ever talked about doing movie nights with Discord, and would you? Yes, I have, and yes, I will. <laughs> um, I believe Violet messaged me the rabbit thing on Discord. I haven't checked that out yet, but I um, I believe she did message that to me and was suggesting it to me. Um, so we could do some uh, Robin movie nights. I would very much uh, love to um, pay it back for you guys who very much support me. Um by subscribing and bitsin and donating and all that jazz and even just watching, you know. I but I you know the, the I definitely want to um for for you Robins who have been so incredibly loyal and the new Robins and old, you know, I very much appreciate it. And if you didn't know I have a Discord, if you check the links section um, below the stream page, you'll see uh that's where that is. But um yes. Um I very much appreciate you guys and would love to pay it back in some way. Like that. That sounds fun. Um, I, I've been taught, I, that's one of the things I wanted to kind of offer early on. So, um, yes, totally down for that. And thank you for asking that. Cause, uh, I don't know when that would have come up again, but I, I've definitely been thinking about it. Um, and try, it also tries trying to set up a community call times, like where we can, well, not call times, but you know, community, community chat times where we can kind of even like just general chat, all meet up in the discord and just chat. Uh, off stream. That'll be fun. You're my best friend. Now that song stuck in my head. And I haven't even heard that song since, like, the movie came out. Pretty much, like, I was playing it on stream but at the time. But. Went to the Discord, but it says you're not a Robin. Oh, yes. It it, it automatically, it, it takes, like, I don't have to manually refresh it. It automatically does. Um, It manually, if, if I manually refresh it, it happens faster. But, um. Uh, it automatically updates every 15 minutes, I think, so, um, yes. It'll, it'll reflect soon, but yes, you could always, if you are a Robin, you can sign up on the Discord, or just, uh, click the link to the Discord. If you already have Discord, it'll just go over there. If not, you can set up your Discord account, and all that jazz. I'm not sponsored by Discord, but Discord, 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 um, it's just a fun kind of community way, because people have asked, like, why do you have a Discord? And it's just like, oh, well, it's because I thought it'd be cool. Um, a way to, like, kind of talk with everybody, and have a cool community, and, um, also a cool way to kind of just communicate differently. It'd be fun. I haven't really done anything like that in a while, and it reminds me of a message board a little bit, and I love that because I am an old-timey message boarder. Um, I haven't message boarded in quite a while, um, but I, uh, I like going in there and kind of catching up a little bit. Um, I haven't been, uh, partaking in too many of the conversations, um, and that's gonna change, but, um, the movie conversation and stuff, I try to give my two cents with, um, um, different, uh, well, we don't need this yet. We can keep it stone up to a certain point and kind of fill this in towards this way. Um, but yeah, we have the gaming discussion, movie discussion, and it's fun just going in there and chatting and, uh, getting to know everybody and all that jazz. Um, and then the 10 hour streams we've had, um, uh, the first 10 hour stream we had, uh, a really fun time doing... Uh, quiplash with with Robins, um, that was super fun. Um, we've done a couple times where we just popped into the Discord. I think we, we I've played Overwatch before where it's just like we we got in voice chat and had a good time hanging out chatting. That's not Discord, but you know. 
yes, I have, Trevor. Yeah, no, I had seen that before the movie came out, before Suicide Squad came out, just comparing the the scars and stuff. And I think somebody somebody uh, uh, attached to the production, uh, I think, debunked that. Um, but I could be wrong, so that's a thing as well. Filling in bullshit. Isn't it fun just watching somebody place a whole bunch of dirt blocks? But it's fun chatting. I guess that's the thing, too. It's part of the Minecraft, though. It's it's just, like, it's so satisfying just kind of creating shit and getting in here and having fun. Um, definitely not... Um, because uh, people are asking about mods and stuff. I'm definitely not um, averse to it. I'm just not experienced with it. So, um, mods and me sometimes get along. GTA is a little, you know, trying sometimes when I'm trying to get mods going. Um, and even Skyrim. I, I've had to stop my Skyrim, my last Skyrim playthrough. I couldn't really kind of continue off of that um, because I had fucked up the mods and it fucked up my game. And I was just too incompetent to get it working again because I'm just so terrible at mod stuff. I had fucked up the, like the load or something, or something had been updated and it fucked everything else up. I don't even know. So that's it's confusing sometimes. I'm just an old man. I'm just an old man. Leave me alone. What are you kids doing here? And then I wake up and I really am an old man in a hospital bed. And this was all a dream. Da -da -da -da. What about that fan theory, huh? What about that fan theory? <clears throat> you haven't seen Suicide Squad, Violet? You're not missing a terrible amount, but I mean, it's 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 worth watching. <laughs> I need I still need to watch the extended edition. You've heard me say I don't see about how I need to go back and watch the extended edition. I definitely need to do that. Um, I've heard it doesn't really help, but uh, curiosity certainly killed a cat and then Jared Leto sent that dead cat to a cast member and was like that's what the Joker does I send gifts gifts are the Joker's things mm, evil gifts I am very tempted to just make this hill hollow gonna do that gonna do that um, so let's and I'm just gonna Fill it full of torches and hope shit doesn't spawn there. Dun, 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 dun. Careless Dan, careless Dan, does whatever a careless Dan does. Oh, I had a good thing going there, and then it had to end. Oh yeah, well. Hey, dude, drop. How you doing? Welcome to my rock opera. <laughs> um, no, I'm just being stupid. Um, speaking of Spider-Man, are you excited for Homecoming? I am, and I am. Yes, quite. I don't know what Kirsten Dunst is on about. Um, did anybody see Kirsten Dunst quote talking about how um, she was just like, nah, they just keep remaking them for the money. Well, yeah, but they're also real storytellers. You know, Sony's remaking it for the money. There are real storytellers working on the movie. So, I mean, there's real people who, who worked on movies before, who, you know, make movies. I understand. I understand, like, her seeing the Amazing Spider-Man movies and seeing how they're kind of just forgettable. Um, and <laughs> then being like, they're just doing it again. But, I mean, I, maybe she doesn't know about all the Marvel stuff. Maybe. I don't know. Like, you know, because I think I, I, Marvel's, you know, certainly got... They haven't fucked up in a while. So, or, or, yeah, they haven't really fucked up in a while. So... I'd imagine it's going to be pretty great. Um, let me make sure this is just torched to hell down here. Um, so we don't get any baddies spawning in a corner or something. Because I'm just going to make this hollow because I'm a lazy fuck. <laughs> right? The song's beautiful. She also kissed Tobey Maguire, so I know. I'd love to kiss Tobey Maguire. With a chicken at present. Um, let's speaking of chickens and kissing Toby Maguire, let's sex it up, baby. 
Dun, dun, chicken sucks in music, apparently that is... Oh, I'm sorry, my game audio is extremely loud. Um, and I didn't realize until just now, so hopefully that has been too loud this time, entire time. By the way, sheep, you are... Just stay out, get the lesson. I've slaughtered so many sheep. <sighs> How many Robins had, Batman had, and what happens to them in the Batman universe? Have to ask how many Robins had Batman had? What? Like how many Robins has Batman had total? I don't know. I mean throughout his entire span, who knows? I really haven't followed much of the Kamek backs. So I don't know all that stuff. And you know, I don't I haven't seen all the cartoons and such. But I mean, like, I can count four? Damien, Tim, Dick, um, and Jason. So that's four, right? Uh, that I know of. What do you think Tom Hardy cast as Venom? I love Tom Hardy in anything, so I'm totally down. Hey, Shy Violet! Donate, donating just because I can now. Oh, thank you so much, Violet. I appreciate that. The two dollars. Violet. Do do do. Um. Donating just because I can now. Can you tell me some of some and what happens to them? What? I have no idea what you're on about, Trevor. But I I don't know. Yes. What? Um, disregard the P at the end of that. All right, Blackjack. Yeah, Dick, Jason, Tim, Damien. Yeah, I think that's four. Am I being quizzed right now, Trevor? I don't know what's happening. Um, oh, shit. Dropped an egg. Let's load the Lancher and then fire those off real quick and then get back to... Well, we probably should grab more dirt. I know I have a little bit more, but that's not going to be enough. Firing my eggs. Firing my eggs. Oh, the other one grew up. He'll be the new, the new Overwatcher. The new chicken Overwatcher. Well, it's whoever dies, you know, they're getting hit. They're getting pelted a lot. How have they not died? Does the glass, does being born in glass make them, you know, reverse glass? You know, strength? Is that what's happening here? Is this some unbreakable shit? Joker has captured them. There you go. That answers it all. Some of the Robins. What? Are you talking about talking about my Robins? Or I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening, Trevor. Or are you just curious and figure I know? Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> yeah, something like that, Joe Bro. I don't know. I don't know anything about Damien being. I've just heard he's he's Robin now. I should harvest my bullshit. Oh, that's gonna take a little bit, but I'll do it soon. Hey, I was doing I was doing bat dance a little, but then my voice cracked, so that was weird. You want to know about Robin becoming Joker? Oh, well no, that's not really there's there's one there's an iteration where Joker killed a Robin by t pretty much turning him into the Joker, right? Doesn't isn't that a thing? Um but I think he kills him that way in one of the in one of the cartoons. I remember that was the thing. Um, but I've never never Robin becoming the Joker, like full on as the Joker. But I mean, I don't think that's the case in this one. I mean, uh, Jared Leto is the same age as Batman for the mo or as like Ben Affleck. He's a couple years either younger or older. Tim is apparently dead currently in the comics, but not sure what happened. <laughs> Didn't read it. Oh, geez. Man, Batman just can't. I mean, well, well, it's inevitable. He can't keep people alive. All right. Uh, let's go grab some more dirt after we wake up here. Um, but yeah, Batman, like, you know, if he keeps just bringing kids in, they're just going to die. They're kids. They're children. They're, they're, they're children. They are going to make mistakes. <laughs> he was He was an adult when he started doing the Batman stuff. He wasn't a kid. I mean, he was training, but like he wasn't out on the streets doing bullshit. E.T. was alive once. Aw, oh, that cuts deep there, Trevor. That cuts deep. How dare you? How dare you? 
<laughs> um, but yeah. All right, we got pretty much the rest of the dirt that we have um, in stock. We're going to have to re-dirt up at some point. I've had a long stock of dirt. A fair a fair good back stock. Fair good. A good fair back stock. All right, um, what's the best way to eventually connect this? All right, let's do this. So from here, I'm just going to keep it at this level. That is, oh, not that level, this level. So, let's just do this. New my new my yahoo, new my aha. <laughs> did he kill the last ET in Kingdom? No, I did not. ET was still alive by the end of it. And that's where we wrapped Kingdom for quite a bit on the stream. We'll be coming back to that, um, I'd say, in um, a month or so. It'll be a little break. I was thinking Minecraft could kind of take the place of that, because that's this is a game we could spend a fair bit of time in. I could still chat with the chat, have fun, um, tell some stories, uh, smoke a little bit. You know, I need a little bit of Blaze stream. It's been a couple days since I smoked, and uh, just wanted to chillax, have fun. I wasn't going to smoke, but then Guardians fucked up, so I was just like, eh, let's just lay back, have fun. <laughs> so we should say what happened. Oh, no. My, my wife. My my wife. My wife, yes. My wife. My wife. She was a beautiful lady. And, oh, I'm using past tense. I mean, she's beautiful. She totally was all right and didn't get taken. <sighs> <clears throat> it was my fault. It's never my fault. It's not my fault. It's not my fault. It's about to do a weird voice, and that backfired. <laughs> I'm going to make this like a weird little dip right here, because why the fuck not? I am the creator. This is your world. You're the creator. Find freedom on this canvas. You sing it, Bob. Uh, okay, let's finish torching this place, too. <laughs> uh, let's just do that. Whatever. Um, there's going to be a lot of torches close to each other, but it's going to be dark down here, so maybe it'll be darker. Uh, Alright. This isn't looking too bad, because it's not going to go too much farther than here-ish. Sure, that's good for now. That's a waste of torches, but sure. <laughs> Better than dirt, right? Hey, Lord Marin, how are you doing? Welcome back to the stream. Let's have a good time. Lord Marin is here, so let's have a good time. Welcome to the stream. That place for everybody who comes in the stream, by the way. Um, so, yeah. Just a forewarning. It's an automated thing. That I set up, you know. I spent a lot of time on that. Over the week programming that and all that jazz, so yeah. Dan, your favorite actor is Topher Grace, right? Yeah, I'm. I, you know, in fact, I'm. I'm furious that Tom Hardy was cast, um, and Topher wasn't offered to come back because, you know, Topher can beef up. You know, I've, we've seen it happen before. We've seen the Ocean's Eleven movies. He's in the first two of them for some reason. He's not in the third one for some reason. I thought they probably would have brought him back, but apparently they didn't. So that's a thing. Um, but you know what, Topher, you know, he he's a party animal. You know. Uh, hey Jamie, do 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 do. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> then it keeps happening. Hey Jaime, I'm sorry. I'm, never, I'm not gonna keep calling you Jaime with that. Hey Jaime, Jaime is Jaime. Jaime, it's Jaime. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Dan, favorite Rob Williams movie? Mm, Awakenings, maybe. Let me think about that. Man, I loved Aladdin growing up. That was, I mean, that was my... Aladdin was my first, like... You know, I, I'm, I'm, I'm so over the moon to see that people's response to Wonder Woman has been really great. And, you know, I love the, the whole um, females finally getting, like, you know, an on-screen hero they can fucking root for. And, like, I, you know, I'm not saying, like, in a, in a solo movie and all that jazz. But, you know, it's, it's nice seeing, like, there's a lot of people who are coming out and saying, you know, this this movie is very important to me. And that's fucking awesome. Um, 
you know, my, that movie for me, I, you know, it's crazy that it's taken them this long to get it. But um, that movie for me was Aladdin. You know, that was the movie that I was just like, holy shit, I want to be this kid. <laughs> you know, I wanted to I wanted to be Aladdin. I was running around in the backyard just fucking. And then I saw Blade and then I was like, I fucking want to be Blade. And then that that stuck for the rest of my life. I, I still want to be Blade. Um, but yeah. Hey, this is almost done. Hey, oh, oh, it is done. All right. We have that weird little pool thing here. And that's just a. Weird little thing that happened. We don't talk about it. We're making it look like unique Minecraft land. That's what we're doing, so just bear with me. Oh, and I'm... Oh, no, no, no. Not our dirt. Cool. And we didn't have to use all of our fucking dirt, and it all should be well lit under there enough that, um... You know, fucking assholes don't come around, you know? Um, let's get rid of this. This is looking stupid. <laughs> I don't like the hole. <laughs> It took me all about two seconds to think about that, but Blade was epic. I know Bl Blade. When I saw that movie, I was just like, this is fucking, you know, cause I didn't grow up with Kung Fu movies or anything. So Blade was Kung Fu to me, you know, I didn't, I wasn't in, uh, you know, I, I never watched the Bruce Lee movies. I grew up with Westerns, um, uh, Disney movies, Blade, you know, I grew up with a pretty good palette of movies. You know, my, my grandparents were, um, very much into movies. They had all of the newest movies. Their friend Georgie would bootleg them off of um, HBO and tape them for all of her friends and make copies. <laughs> and like she literally bootlegged, like, you know, would give them to her friends. And so my grandparents always had the newest movies um, on VHS. So we watched them all the time. We went to my grandparents all the time. Um, so that, you know, that was a education in cinema growing up. Um, uh, thanks to my grandparents. Um, I saw a lot of random movies growing up, but, um, and my parents never really much cared too much, depending on the movie, but you know, they, they were, they were not ever really hyper strict about what I watched. I remember I was like 14, 13 or 14, maybe 14 or 15. No, nah, I was like, yeah, I was like 15 or 16 actually. Um, and you know, I'm still not 18 and I, I, I watch radar movies all the time. It's not like banned or anything. I'm just collecting eggs. That's why I'm running around in circles. Um, and I remember watching um, Double Jeopardy. And if you've never seen Je Double Jeopardy... Well, anyway, I w remember watching Double Jeopardy, and I'm like, man, this movie's fucking great. Like, I love this movie. And I know my parents My parents like kind of, like, just um, kind of thrillers like that. Um, I'd say that's a thriller kind of, right? Yeah. Is that a thriller? It's, you know, it's just one of those movies. It's, it's Tommy Lee Jones hunting somebody and he did a lot of those movies um and I, they love the fugitive they love u.s marshals and i, I figured they like they love that but <laughs> very early on in the movie there's like i always like so i'm gonna show it to them um and so we sat down and we were watching it and it was just me and my mom and dad and we were because we, i would I, I i love watching movies with my family or movies with my family that's one of the reasons why i love going to mo see movies with everybody else you know my friends and stuff like i like seeing it. blade is marvel yeah blade was one of the first uh blade was before x-men um, you know, Blade was 99, 98, 98. Um, you know, Blade was the first, and it was a rated R Marvel movie, and they made three of them, and it's, they're fucking amazing, and I wholly hope they bring back Wesley Snipes as Blade. Apparently, he's had meetings with Marvel. Who knows? Marvel Studios. So, I would, it, that would blow my fucking mind if they brought Wesley Snipes back, and he's still looking great. He's still, he's, he's bigger than when he was Blade, so, I mean, he'd be hulky Blade now. Um, that would, I, anything with, uh, Wesley Snipes, I will watch, so. <laughs> You're back to smoke that dank shit. Oh, yeah. If it's legal and you are of age, Crazy Bob, because it's legal for me in my state and I am of age. Disclaimer. An hour into the stream. Um, but yes. So we fired out all of the eggs. And now we will celebrate by building more fence. Yes. Um... But yeah, all of that. So yeah, no, the, my, I grew up with a lot of movies, and was I making a point other than that? Where was I going with that? So the fence will... So this was acting as part of the wall. So the fence will, like I said, kind of come around to here, maybe? I'll, I guess I'll do it along here, along the edge. Maybe? Does that make sense? I guess she could drop down if it really wanted to. If I really stick with using the mountain. Because I just use this mountain pass here. Hmm. Eh, this is a weird kind of fence, but whatever. 
Uh, let's just do what I was planning with earlier. Let's just do this. We'll do this. It's weird, but it should work. It should work for what I'm trying to do here. They're popping out their eggs. Um, so whatever the point of that story I was telling and all of that jazz. Um, I can't remember if I was going anywhere with it, but that, yeah, no, it was, it was crazy the amount of movies I watched. Um, oh yeah, I, I told the double jeopardy thing. That's one of the points. I think that was a tangent, but yes. Dan, take off your sunglasses. You're indoors. Da fine. For a little bit until I smoke again, and then I'm totally putting them back on. It's going to be legal in Canada in like a year. That's close enough. There you go. Canadians are the best people in the world. Do -do -do. There, I said it. No, they're pretty damn great. Love me some Canadians. Welcome, Canadians, if you are in here. I think me doing all that fire stuff took out some of the uh, torches that were initially in here. They did, and I shall replace them. You fucking sheep. Well, I'll slowly just kill all the sheep because I'm not fucking them. I'm not, I mean, I'm not making them fuck, you know? I'm not fucking them. I'm not fucking them. Um, <laughs> um, okay, maybe once or twice. But the sheep... I'm sorry, chickadees. I didn't mean to hit you, too, but it's just a byproduct of killing the sheep. Um... But slowly they'll just thin out and they'll be gone. Da -da -da -da. Dan's trying to hide the fact that he's not bad, Dan's. Exactly. I'm wearing... Those are like my um, glasses glasses. No, I just like wearing them on stream, especially when I spoke, because I, I look like an idiot when I fucking start... I just look stupid and I don't like it. So that's why I wear the sunglasses. Because I look stupid when I get high. Do, do, do. You know, because I already have the smaller eye in, in general. I have ptosis, which is like... It's kind of just like... The eyelid isn't quite as open. Uh, I, I th it might be a muscle thing, or it's... I don't know. Um, but I've had it as, you know, my entire life. Um, it's ptosis with a silent P in the front. Um, uh, plenty of great actors you know have it. Forrest Whitaker. I used to call it Forrest Whitaker system, uh, syndrome before I knew what it was. Um, and I've seen, you know, at some points, his, his eye is really, like, closed. Like, really closed. Um... But I, mine gets there when I'm fucking high. It gets really, it re gets really close shut. You looked up how Tim Drake died. There you go, Blackjack. Blackjack put it in there. That's how Tim Drake died. We know. Mike's super short show. Okay, so this part's fenced in. Let's go back in and sleep, I think. I'm hearing some assholes around. Um, let's go back to the house, sleep real quick. And then get this fence roped around. Uh, just kind of like up around down here. And then up the hill and or up and down or something like that, and then we'll be we'll be good. We'll be fenced in, um, and we'll be all set there. Maybe I'll just keep it tight to the walkway, maybe, and the just up there. Uh, maybe no, I like being able to walk around a little bit. Maybe I don't know. What do you guys think? You think that'd be weird? Um, died, quote unquote. Here, I'm going to read that block of text real quick. Oh, okay. Hmm. Interesting. Man, comic books are interesting. <laughs> I haven't, I haven't, uh, I really do need to start reading them again at some point, but I just never... I've never been a regular comic book reader. It's more so I just kind of wait for the lines to come out and then people afterwards be like, oh, this is a really good one. Although I haven't really caught up in the last, you know, 10 years or so or seven years. Um, Dan, what'd you do that the carrot that you found? It's in this one. It's right there. And it's right now. I'm going to get some piggies. If you watched American Gods, I have not. Favorite Batman score, Elfman or Zimmer? Probably Elfman. Well, that's more so the animated series, but you know what I'm saying. No, that's it. It's me just doing that for the next five hours, just saying. But yes, um... Uh, yeah, I, I would say, you know, Zimmer certainly 
um, tread far new ground, and he made something wholly unique, nothing like um, Elfman, um, nothing. He made something incredibly unique and amazing and, and unforgettable and indelible. The, the cinematic language of composing from then on. So many movies tried to replicate what Zimmer tried to replicate. <laughs> Just, you know, pretty much. Well, no, Zimmer is a very incredibly diverse composer. Um, but there's points where he definitely falls back on some, some, some classic tropes of his. Um, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go through and, and quickly just harvest some of this. Um, just some of it, maybe half the field or so. We don't need to harvest the entire field. But you might as well be getting used to the time while it's just sitting here to get more shit. That way we don't have to go the entire... We don't have to just waste... Um, or we can, we can build up more wheat while not having to clear out the entire field. But yes, um, no, Zimmer, Zimmer, I mean, that, that, that score is incredibly important, but Danny Elfman's was, I, I don't think, I don't see will ever be topped. If Giacchino did the Batman because he's working with Matt Reeves on Dawn of the Planet of the Apes, and he seems to be a very hot composer right now, he seems to be kind of the next Zimmer um, somewhat when it comes to uh, particularly the superhero genre. Now that Zimmer's out of the way, um, now that Zimmer's taken himself off the field, um, Chikino has stepped right in very comfortably um, with Marvel. Um, and I'd imagine some point, um, uh, hopefully DC, because he did Doctor Strange. Um, and he's done some iconic Disney scores at this point. That's some dank wheat. I know, right, man? <laughs> All right, man. <laughs> and then I have a seizure. That's nothing to joke about. I don't. I'm not prone to seizures. And if you are, that sucks. I'm sorry. I've known I've known people to have um, that issue. Luckily, um, I remember uh, Allie, my next-door neighbor, she ended up... Uh, she had seizures well into her... Right around her teenage years, they kind of started subsiding. It was more so... Um, I th it was just kind of random bouts. Um, it was she never knew when it was going to happen, um, and luckily it's it ended up subsiding. I don't know if it was if it was because of medication medication or if it just ended up kind of going into um, remission somewhat, just not really happening. But yeah. Anyway, a joke followed by a rebuttal followed by um, a story. Yay. Mmm, a shave. Mmm, a shave. I guess. I don't know. Elfman score is probably more recognizable. Yeah, yeah. Although, dun, 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 uh, uh. You know, the last two scores for Batman have been just, like, noises kind of going. Because, of the, you know, the new Batman score, which I fucking love, do not get me wrong. Um, you know, the dun, 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 dun. Duh, is literally just taking kind of the Hans Zimmer duh, and then just playing it repeatedly. But it's still fucking awesome and gets me pumped, believe me. And it, it fits perfectly for Batman v Superman. But I hope they kind of rewrite the main theme of the new Batman. I would hope, at least. That's just a hope of mine. Especially if Giacchino does it, man. Time to share stories. Well, if, if they come to me, I, it's not too often that I can really kind of think of a story that's fun to tell. Plus, I have a horrible memory. I've been long stricken with a horrible, horrible memory. Um, I remember, like, there were points, like, because I, I grew up, the first 10 years of my life, I, I grew up, I, you know, I've just moved around a lot throughout my life. So, you know, first 10 years, here we go, story time, here we go. This is literally, I was just talking about how terrible I am at telling stories and I'm going into a story. Or at least the story of my life, I guess. Um, grew up in Niagara Falls, New York, first nine years of my life. I actually turned nine um, uh, two days after we moved um, to North Carolina, and, uh, you know, I was, that was nine years of my life, and in, in New York, um, in, in Western New York, and I don't, I, like, I, I do remember, I do remember plenty, it's just, I don't remember, like, a lot of the instances, because the, uh, all my siblings, I have, I have, um, four siblings, it, we're five kids, um, I have three sisters and a brother, and, um, my, uh, each sibling, um, cause I was the baby for six years of my life and then I, my little sister was a surprise and, uh, she's in the chat every once in a while, Dehabes. Um, 
Thankfully, she's not here right now, and she doesn't watch stream vods. Um, but um, no, she no, she knows she was a surprise. Um, but um, it, you know, love my little sister. Wouldn't you know? I I love that. Um, surprises happen, but I was the last planned child, and so th there is a very kind of like two year, two and a half year gap between each kid. So my brother is six years older than me. My sister Katie is. Um, all right, sexing time. Uh, my sister Katie is like four years older than me, and my sister Kelly is about two years older than me. Um, we're, I think maybe two and a half or something like that. Because she just turned 30. Um, I'm 27. Um, so I'm, uh, well, although, I, you know, in a few months, um, I'll be turning 28. Ooh, that's weird. I'm excited for that. Eight. I'll have an eight in my number, or in my, in my age. Eight's my favorite number, so that's perfect. Oh, man. That'll be awesome. Um, so, yeah, we, we all have two-year gaps, and they were older than me, so, you know, they were in their teenage years. My brother was, brother and sister were in their teenage years, and then Kelly was, you know, like, 11 when we moved. Um, so, it was, you know, they, they remembered a lot more about home, so, you know, I, I, I kind of just um, had those times where it's just like, you know, I can't remember that, although I was young, but at the same time, you know, you have, you have young memories, I guess, or do, you, do some people just not hold on to those? Because some people have vivid... I've, I've watched so many interviews where people just have these vivid um, stories about their, their childhood. And I just can't... I can't really tell you too great many. Do you have an earliest memory? I think... See, I think I have an earliest memory. It's just, you know, like... It's one of those things where it's like at some point... Um, see, that's the thing. is like I'm never quite sure about my memory. That's the thing. Um, but the, the earliest memory I, I can recall is I remember my mom, um, throwing away my, like, well, not throwing away, but well, yes, throwing away. It was, it's not a traumatic experience, but it's what I remember. I don't remember feeling sad about it. Well, I was sad. Never mind. I'm just defending it when it's not defendable, I guess. Um, I do, my earliest memory is I remember, um, my, uh, asking my mom where my binky was. Because, like, it was the last time I ever, like, she she, she threw away my, um, binky, because she, like, you know, uh, you know, I was, I was too old. Like, I was just done being binky age or whatever, which was, must have been three, two? When do you stop having a binky? I don't know. That's pretty early. But, like, or it was my bottle. No, it wasn't my binky. It was my bottle. It was a bottle. So I was asking my bottle. So, I, yeah, I was probably, like, three or four. Or five. Something like that. No, I would have been three or four. Yes, that is correct. Because, um, yes, the house that we were in, yes, I would have been four, I believe. Um, so I asked, I was like, Mom, you know, what, what happened to my bottle? She said she threw it away. And I remember seeing, um, the, it was the morning. It was in the morning. And the garbage truck was going by right then. <laughs> and so I was just like, you know, like, that's the early, that's the earliest thing I remember. <laughs> it's, a, it's just like this, it's like this mass disappointment. In, in life is my first memory. Isn't that hilarious? <laughs> See, that's why I have such a dark sense of humor. I laugh at everything that's just, like, traumatizing. There you go. Is that is that something I should tell a therapist? Don't have the best relationship with my mom. Uh -huh. But, you know, we're working on it. We're, we're, we're chatting again. There was, a, there was a long period where I was not talking to my mother, which, you know, is never a healthy thing to do. So there you go. <laughs> Tell us a high school story with Joe. Hmm. I've kind of told a lot of them on stuff. Let me make sure I'm kind of. I'm gonna go back and put all this um, wheat and seed back. Did I sex chickens at all? I sexed them a little bit. Um, I'm too busy focused on the stories and stuff.